See how you can measure the motion of objects using the distance sensor, the BBC microbit and iLog data logging software. The sensor measures the distance by detecting the echoes of ultrasound reflected by the model car. The microbit sends the readings to the computer where they get displayed by iLog software. A graph of distance against time is a key tool for both measuring and analysing motion. Let's move the car forwards and backwards. The rising line shows the car moving away from the sensor. The flat part shows where it stopped. The falling line shows the car moving towards the sensor. So it is easy to tell the direction of motion from the shape of the graph. We can use a cursor to read out all the recorded readings. We can also work out the speed using a rate of change cursor. The steeper the line, the faster the speed. Negative speed shows backwards motion. The distance graph lines here are not perfectly straight. There are quite a few wobbles showing that the speed was not as steady as we might have thought. iLog can show us another graph showing the speed at all points on the line, confirming these variations. However, the average speeds turn out as before. If we plot an ideal straight line for the distance graph, the corresponding gradient graph shows perfectly steady speed values for the forward and backward motion. These examples show how the iLog graphs and analysing tools help us learn about motion.